new migrants could be sent to live in the bush to ease our population boom. On the edge of Sydney's rolling hills district, along with the horses, houses are now popping up in the middle of paddocks. In the next few years, prime farmland will be transformed into 10,000 family-friendly homes and they're likely to fetch big figures. It might not look like much now, but welcome to Sydney's newest million dollar postcode. Box Hill on the fringe of the city's northwest is booming. The northwest sector is bucking the trend, the demand is quite good, it suits a lot of people, families, investors, older couples. The suburb's transformation is being driven by projects like the Gables, a four billion dollar master plan where 4,000 homes will be finished by 2025. To date we've sold about 750 uh, lots and we've still got a fair way to go. In the last two months, two houses on this busy street have resold for six figures. It doesn't come as a surprise to us because we are investing such um, amount of capital um, into this development. Those proposed perks include sports fields, a town centre and a local primary school. A short distance down the road, just under 3,000 new lots have been made available. Prices starting at $400,000. Well, we basically moved out here because Sydney is a bit unaffordable. Um, better priced out here, the infrastructure's a lot better out here. It's all new and it's an up-and-coming area. In the houses that we used to live in before, they were smaller and we have much more like freedom and there's more people to play with. Just two years ago, in this part of Box Hill, everything looked like this. Rural farmland. Now, it's starting to look a little more like this a hive of activity where developers are building thousands of homes for Sydney families. And the infrastructure's not far behind. In six months, the North West Rail will open, providing a link from the hills to the CBD. Will be great. I mean, I probably still work for a couple of years and uh, they tell me it's only going to be a 15 minute trip into Chats Chatswood. But for now, some are enjoying the last moments of tranquility before everyone else moves in. A few more neighbours, a few more children, a bit of noise, that'll be great. The Australian dream, as they say. Charlotte Goodlett, Nine News.